So next up, we're gonna be jumping actually onto the suspension trainer to actually focus on our upper bodies. We're gonna be doing, um, I suppose it's like a, it's not quite a fly and it's not quite a press, but it's an incredibly effective exercise uh, and you can, you can vary the resistance by depending on how close or how far away your feet are. If your feet are further away, i.e. you are more horizontal, you are gonna be putting more load. You know, if you look at physics, um, pivots and fulcrums, you know, the, the further away your feet are, the more load you've got. The closer your feet are, the less uh, resistance is gonna go through. What I'd like you to think about doing is keeping the shoulder blades pulled back all the time. Um, at the bottom of the movement, you're gonna be getting a, a big stretch going through your chest and then you're gonna to squeeze together and then we go from a press and then into a fly there, okay? Nice and controlled and we come back down. I'll show you what I mean. And as always, if you need me to help you any more, just ask me, it's a, it's a great exercise. So like I said, the further away you have your feet, i.e. your feet are back here, there's going to be um, more tension than if your feet are up here. Okay, I like to have my feet quite far back. Okay, so you're going to start off with your hands underneath your shoulders, you're going to bring your shoulder blade back, and then you are nice and controlled. You're going to go down into the bottom. Big stretch. And then squeeze your chest together. Okay, under control. All the time. Squeezing your glutes, squeezing your core. Big stretch going through your pecs. And then squeeze them back together. So it's like a fly, but it's also like a press.